Yes. <laughs> anyway, sir, I you digress. No, be I can't talk. I will go debate that one later. Okay. All right. right we will debate that one later. Uh -huh. <laughs> so, the thing where what I want to say is this: you see, they don't practice Christianity in Nigeria. They practice, according to Doctor Charles Apoki, he says uh, they practice traditional African religion in the gap of Christianity. Right. So, which is true, which is true. So now, uh, I hope I can preach, but I just use some small, small Bible quotation to support uh, that. Preach, oh, if First you want to preach, oh, because me, I, I, I don't want to give out uh, the impression as if to say, you know, uh, I've said this many times, right, that. Uh, Except for mm. those who want to use their fraudulent manipulation so as to keep people under their control, so you get everyone. Yes. Has, I mean, every religion yes. is private, and therefore, eh, yes. you can preach. Oh, please uh -huh. tell me. Okay, uh, this is Ecclesiastes chapter ten, verse sixteen. Right. It says, "Woe to you, O land, when your king is a child, and when your incompetent officials and hmm. princes feast in the morning." See? So it says, woe to you. I was in the Bible talk. So all woe those things where they preach on Nigeria. Your leaders are like, like, like a child. Hmm. Yes. And they are incompetent. All they do is to feast. Exactly. That describes Nigeria. So now, uh, just as everybody knows, the leadership no come from Mars. Abby? No. They are all Nigerians too. Yes. Uh -huh. So which kind of shows the general, you know, is a kind of, from there, you go feed judge the general behavior of the people of the, that the, particular the, country. Uh, that. What do you call it? Uh, the leadership of Nigeria, they are the reflection of uh, the people, no doubt. <laughs> well, well, exactly. Hmm. So now I get another Bible quotation again, what I want to read. Go on. This one, Second uh, Timothy chapter 3, from 1 to 9, you no know, long. Right. But just pay attention. Okay. It says, but mark this, what did you call it? Second, terrible second time. Timothy. Yes, Second Timothy chapter three, verse one to nine. Go on. It says, "But mark this: there will be terrible times in the last days. Hmm. People who will be lovers of themselves, typical Nigerian; lovers of money, typical Nigerian; boastful, typical Nigerian; proud, typical Nigerian; abusive, disobedient to their parents. Okay, this is disobedient to their parents because their children make a keep them by the side." Hmm. Ungrateful, a typical Nigeria. Unholy describes a typical Nigeria. Without love, I don't <laughs> unforgiving, slanderous, without self-control, brutal, not lovers of good, treacherous, rash, conceited. Conceited means somebody that is overly, you know, uh, excessively proud of uh, himself or herself. Hmm. Hmm. Uh, lovers of pleasure rather than lovers of God. That describes a typical Nigeria. Having a form of godliness, but denying its power. This one, I want to come on this one. Having a form of godliness, that is to say, he's just a hypocrite. Hmm. He is professing to be a Christian, but when it comes to his character, it is anything but. So the idea we ain't denying its power, because if that power was active in him, where they, they claim say him be Christian, he no gonna do many of these things. Where they gonna do, for example, right? Uh, focusing on on tithe. As a, I have said it in this part on this platform. As a Christian, you are not supposed to be paying tithe. You you do not, because the reason where they pay tithe back in those days, and I say it was to maintain the temple, and that temple was run by the, the tribe of Levite, the Levites. God say they are not going to get any inheritance. From the 12 tribes, the other, the other 11 tribes will get land and all that. But the, yep. the, the, the whatever Levi, they're not going to get anything because they are owner for the temple. But they will chop sand. No, the tithe is not to That's why they will break care of their them. own uh, farm produce and all that to them. 10% exactly. of it they bring it to the church uh, to feed uh, the people in the temple. The, temple. the Levites, I remember. Yes. Uh -huh. Good. So now, wh which temple will we get today? Which temple? Now There's no God. And then Bishop, like all of them, they uh -huh. get now. No, that's not the temple, my, my, my brother. Hmm. That's not temple. Because what the Bible says is that when the Christians, you know, Christians started from Jesus Christ, right. when the Christians, like when they want to meet, when they want to meet, they, they meet in private homes. You understand? Hmm. Or they will go hire somewhere, but not small, 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 small places. Not elaborate 
big, huge auditorium, auditoriums. And by the way, even if you say that auditorium big, that is not a temple. Because when you talk about temple, you know what you like, oh, come on. Have you seen the temple? I what they call I mean anger. Have you, they don't they don't use them anymore? But you see, you see the massive real estate. That is what a temple is. That's in way it's a, it's a big auditorium, but you know qualified to be temple. Hmm. Therefore, tight paying as a Christian is wrong. It is actually a sin. Paul, Apostle Paul, eh? or Saint Paul, as some other people call him, when he in Tokam say the time when the, the him and the partner go one place go preach. Now their first time there, what did they do there? They, he said they toiled day and night. They toiled what day and night, and night which means they were doing menial jobs. Because I know if you toilet day and night inside office, mm. nah, uh, which kind of toilet be that one? Where you, you push your job? No? Mm. So, Mark, finish that one here. Yeah, Mark, continue the reading because I stop for uh, five. Now, nah, Mark, go to six. Okay. It says, they are the kind whom, oh, sorry, who warm their way into homes and gain control over gullible women, of course, men too, who are loaded down with sins and are swayed by all kinds of evil desires. Hmm. You see, huh? I do with you. Always, always learning, but never able to come to the knowledge of uh, to a knowledge of the truth. Just as Janice and Jambres oppose Moses, so also these teachers who oppose the truth, they are men of what depraved minds, who, as far as the faith, as far as the faith is concerned, are rejected. But they will not get very far because, as in the case of those men, their folly will be clear to everyone. Mm. So, with this little preaching, now I do. Mm -hmm. I hope say everybody will carry on for mine. They don't practice Christianity in Nigeria. Thank you very much. Uh, they don't. Uh, I appreciate it. I mean, if I, uh, rather, thank you so much. Okay? Yes. Uh, people know the Thank truth. you. Here you get. But most of the time, yes. a lot of us uh, will rather ignore it and pick on what maybe suits our own uh, preaching. And that's exactly Imag what imagination. we running in that place for a very long time. Yes. So we are doing this for the sake of uh, the younger generation that need to know. Because uh, those who have kept us down from the criminal conditions of manipulating us, eventually mm. they will kind of uh, they will meet their Waterloo soon. At least a lot of uh, young people are beginning to not be interested in this religion of a thing anymore, anyway. And that is not their exactly. Fault, you know? Stay safe, man. Okay? And, 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 you have a good one. That one too. You did, uh, excuse, excuse, I just want to ask one thing, I beg. All right, quickly. Hello. Yeah. Uh, uh, that's uh, this one we talk last. Even the Bible is itself also prophesied that such a thing will happen. Hmm. When people begin to talk rubbish, they talk once and saying, "Our God, we talk." People will begin to lose their faith. But my encouragement to people is this: do exactly what God says hmm. in the Bible. It says, "Whatever you hear, you say, if you say, me talk or Nami do, first of all, go test them whether that thing is from uh, or it's from the devil, because the devil they keep on they transform himself into an angel of light." So please, guys, take your Bible and do your own research. Read do your yourself. own research. You know, it's exactly. time. Five minutes, five mm -hmm. minutes a day. It's okay. Anyway, you know, I don't fair. talk as a rich people for months. You do well. Thank you. You too. Bye. Thank you so bye much. Bye. Have a good one. Okay. So if I, I appreciate the fact that uh, on this platform we do have people who have uh, who are dedicated to their religion for real, and they can be manipulated by the chances. Criminal politicians, they are friends, pastor preneurs, cupid bandits, KQs, eh, and all these terrorist jihadists hiding behind uh, the fact that they are able to read uh, these uh, books to use that in misleading and manipulating the people to keep them, uh, you know, to control them for the sake of uh, their criminal friends, the politicians. So read, read, and read. So on my own diary, political, you are supposed to have that your own mind. And you should not be so daft. You can't be following my own diary, political, all this while, and then you are angry because of this pastor preneurs. You shouldn't be here. You can possibly defend your religions, defend your faith, and, uh, and all of that stuff, right? But you should never defend any kind of a pastor or imam or sheikh. The moment you begin to defend them, you are a, a toast. You do not have any religion. You are just deceiving yourself. 
And we have seen that a lot of Nigerians actually worshipped their own pastors. They worshipped their own uh, uh, imam, a sheikh, and the rest of them. That they actually have a religion. So unfortunate, but I have another caller. Hello there. Hello, my good general. Yes, sir. How are you? I'm good. I'm good. I'm good. I'm good, my brother. I'm good. You are trying. Uh, I'm calling from Italy. It's Wilson again. Wilson. Yeah. How are you today, though? And how is it? Um, um, uh, we are good. We are good. We are good, my brother. Thanks so much, brother. Please. Every, every day that I'm watching your program, in fact, sometimes I get angry. Hmm. I, I got angry. In fact, even self, I will off the thing. I, will, I will even want to break my phone because of because of the Some nepotism. Of the hmm. It's the way they give the thing. Are these are these people so wicked like this? Why are these people wicked? Yeah. When they say, okay, okay, look at. It's just like what the last caller said. I um, I want to use this opportunity to be talking to people. You heard what Peter B said. You are comparing every time they want to compare people to be with this, with the with the, this. Yeah, the twist is it twister, the twister, man, twister, man, twister. Let me say they this don't know talk. Is, they know what in talk. Gets. This man, this man is living his life. Why are you comparing him with Kishe Ore? You said that he, he cannot do this. Is he not somebody that came to 2023 and tell you and say, "Now my turn to this"? You never said anything about it. You are talking about somebody who, who you know, they robbed the election. You are talking about it. He said that you want to turn a uh, night VG to uh, night shift. Is it a crime? Is it not what they do in Western world? Is it a crime? Uh -huh. I don't understand Nigeria. These it's people, intentional. This no, it's intentional. Don't, don't get worked up, all right? That's what I actually tell people, right? You see, Nigerians are very duplicious people, okay? Very duplicious yeah. in the sense that uh, they sometimes will act like they are intelligent, but they are not. Some of uh, some Nigerians, intentionally. They are no way to talk. Are we not doing nice trips here? Are we doing vigil in Europe? Are you doing vigil in America? Who is going Who to anywhere to go and stay uh, Monday to Friday? Or Monday to I Sunday? They even say that, uh, uh, okay, so instead of going to, uh, what about people who go to nightclub? She didn't a weekend, people will go club. Will you I go to club you. from Monday to Saturday? I, uh, In Nigeria, you, you people will go to church. Early mama Monday morning, you go to people for church, they pray. What thing that they do? They, what thing? So my, they know what thing they, they talk, but intentionally, they go twist time. It's intentional. Yes. When, hang on, when Tiflumbu said, Emilio come. And Obi said right. something about say today that person who said the Miloko and this and that say say today do you see anywhere that Yorubas are buying anything cheaper because uh, that simply means that this guy eh doesn't give a damn right. about Yoruba. Some people twisted them. They talk say eh, Obi they attack Yoruba as well. I was like they they are doing that intentionally. They are yeah. doing it intentionally. Yeah. Hmm. So my brother. If you see, like, what happened in the court, they are, they are, that lawyer was saying these people are adults, they are this and that. Yeah. This is to show Nigeria the, what your leaders are, what the, the people leading you people, that is what they are. They don't care about you. They don't care about your children. They don't care what happened to you. The, if you like, help them rig the election, put them in the power there. They don't care about you. No. So if you, if, you, if you, whatever you are doing, you are wasting your time. The people I cry most for is the people that carry hog Christianity, say that they are going to heaven. Nobody is coming to know where to save you. Save yourself first before you talk of, about somebody who is saving you. So let that person save himself. Nobody is saving anybody for anywhere. No. This poverty you are in is caused by you because you are you are you are longer truth no let you no let you do the right thing even the people that is going to church and be saying uh, god uh, go god is this god uh, even the native daughter you know say all of them don't enter tiktok both pastor both native everybody don't enter tiktok extorting yeah. money uh, here and there a gift typing gift give me this one they have everything I don't know when, anyway, the Bible said, uh, let me put from the Bible. You know, uh, say, you know say if you can read the Bible or you can read the, I saw they have their TikTok fast now. They have TikTok yeah. Babalawos now. I'm talking about yes, Babalawos, yes. where they tell people, say that if you do money ritual for them, Baba, yes, yes, things, they, yes, happen, yes, things they occur. Things they happen, man. 
since they have now they now they now they stage now we they uh, they say my people perish lack of, uh, lack of knowledge. Oh, that is what we have, that is what is happening to us. And I want to use this opportunity and tell all Nigeria: if you are waiting for Jesus to come, yeah. Jesus is has already come. He did with you. He's your phone. If you if you know what has been happening in this world before, you can't get what is happening in the world before. But now you can get it at your doorstep. If you like, pretend that you are not seen. You must see the one. Remain ignorant. Now your fault. Remain ignorant. Now your fault. Nobody. Will, no, you shouldn't cry for nobody. Look at David Omai. Look at how he, he said he's a leader. Look at how he's molesting the people that they said. Uh, Nigerians are gullible people. That's what I can say. They are gullible people. If you are fighting for them, you are just wasting your time because they will turn around. They will turn around and turn it to another thing. Look at Peter Obi. He won election. If you think Peter Obi will call for protest, you are just you are just deceiving yourself. If you think that Peter Obi will do more than what he has done, you are just deceiving. He lost war. We Igbos lost war. Nobody who lost war will, uh, will agitate for any war again. So that is why the man is playing careful. The man is being careful. If only few people don't know, make I tell on that. The man is trying to be careful. You know, when, it, he when, it, when that video of him talking about uh, turning night shifts, I mean, night uh, vigil to night shifts, right? Uh, yeah. A lot of people just concluded that it can't make sense now, say the guy no even call for protest after they rigged him. Because okay. the same people go down to the poor, attack him. Stay in the coffee yeah. and possibly yes. what he said and make sure that there's something happened to him. That yes, uh, nah, Nigerians no. actually deserve this uh, TP. In all honesty, yes. though he forced himself on them, oh, but people like say yeah. they deserve him. Anybody yeah. the way they try to talk, say he won't fight for them. Even uh, Shore, our own uh, Shore self, eh, there are those who mm. wanted Shore to either be killed for asking for yes. people to protest to tomorrow. What yes. is your own? Yes, you, you just nonsense. They should kill him, they should jail him. Yeah. Yes, so man. Maybe they deserve no, him. After all, they deserve him. They deserve him. If he, if he tell, if he, I know the Peter. So, uh, since uh, since they inaugurate, uh, uh, they swear to Numbu in. I know they pity anybody where they for Nigeria. Anything where we to me when I take her. You know he You don't get pity again. I don't get uh, apart from my mother where they there. Any other person should. Any other person should face the consequences yeah, because this is. Uh, Shalanga. Okay. These consequences was one. The you people were the one. They said, "Don't go there." Every all of them wanted to be there. At least let them see. Look at fuel from from two hundred to one thousand something. Mm. Now beg they don't go. Mm. Look at nobody even talking. Look at dollar. Dollar is a dollar people is will almost two times. That Jonathan time. People will be saying uh, that nobody, they people will get out to talk that time. Baba, you know, jump yeah. right now. Like everybody uh, just gentle now. Almost. Uh, if now will be <laughs> see if to say now will be be the oppressive idiot right now, yeah. you go down to different different group of CSOs, By civil now, society organizations. This everybody go get him out. They get you go they see different different take. But right now everybody just. Mm. But uh, but uh, my argument, I tell you the truth. Tell me. Do you know the, Do you know the person? It's just like when I do all day. Make I see the people. He was among the people sponsoring Q that time. Yes. That time military Q that time. Mm -hmm. If they don't know, make, they are evil. Will be will be coming out one by one. Tunumbu has been the one sponsoring all the protests in Nigeria. He said it by his mouth, not from my own mouth. He said it. Now he want he want to shut everybody up because he knows he knows how he was up. Uh, Organizing all these things. If to say we will be win now, all these people, you see how they go media. No media is talking about anything. Mm -hmm. Only this thing they will give news, they will give news once. No more. The, the matter will be closed. Do you remember my good that one of our our counter generals to 109 billion? Do you remember you said it in your no, program? You say me smoktar from Kano. She you get it's all 189 billion naira. 189 okay. billion. They give and okay. to okay. to right now in Kano. The number one, okay. they said it, it be it be Emirates. See, I tell you, they give them two two titles, shift and titles. One of the titles eh, is that eh, the number one accountant of the Emirates. I mean, of the Arewa today. Okay, one eighty nine okay. billion. That's how much he stole. Now one and nine. Okay, eh. okay. Where is he? He's at. He's the chief in Kano now. He's taking chief yes. Where is Malami? Malami, the the uh, attorney general. That stole money. Where, he's enjoying, where his is life. The, he's enjoying his life in Dubai. What about Sirika? Adi Sirika, the one where he, he okay. invited that time. Where is he? 
okay. So so Nigerians, eh? I don't I don't understand. Somebody will be people will be never be he'll be governor. If to say that man stole money, let me tell you people, even Soludo could have brought out what he stole. No, no, right they, now, they, right now. They, 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 they could have dig up the information. This man server number, he never took anything, he went away peacefully. Go and dig. He said, Bring it, bring, bring it, let him see. Bring it and come and crucify him. But nobody. Anything he said, you want to change it, you want to, they, they want to no, turn no, it to politics. They get strength. You see, every time uh, we talk, yeah. talk, every time we talk, right, uh, you go see, see a lot of people go get energy. They go yeah. see yes. way in talk. Yes. You get. And yes. it is the same way they actually dealt with uh, Jonathan that time. Yes. But anytime we talk, no one is gang, say something, everybody will just become deaf and dumb. Uh, Yes, you look at Dan Kote, like like what you said about Dan Kote. Dan Kote has been lying to Nigeria. This is a plan between Dan Kote and Tunumbu family. This this going back and front, they are going. We know what they are doing. These people build a refinery. Their refinery need to be servicing. These people, okay, Buhari have given have weld all Nigerian oil to the people that is owing. If Nigeria didn't know, make they know. Buhari stole money. The whole money that he borrowed was in their in the hands of his family. And his cronies, and today, and he still borrow, he still use our oil to make mortgage. Now, now be the problem with Tunumbu then they get. Now Tunumbu them are, are, are trying to find his uh, his own way to see siphoning Nigerian money. Nigerians are there crying, things are hard. Make una cry, make una una deserve Tunumbu, una deserve him. I know they pray, I know they pray for Tunumbu. Thank, Thank you, you very much, much my brother. Uh -huh. God bless Magic, you. Ma, take another one. Eh? You do well. Indeed, you see, uh, anybody we talk say won't fight for Nigerians. In my own opinion, no, she you get now. I mean, I'm not saying because we are all built differently. Anybody we talk saying they fight, we won't fight for Nigeria. Now, two things is either a madman or is uh, a scammer. A madman, in the sense that he don't know what thing they do, is just one mental crazy person who believes that uh, he can. Or a froster who knows what he's doing by trying to leverage on people's gullibility and pretend that I want to fight for you. You can't fight for Nigerians. No, you can't. Because when you try to, that means you want to fight the oppressors for them. No go, they try, they use two hands, they fight the oppressor. Because if you are a madman, you go, they use two hands to fight the oppressors for them. And the Nigerians go, they stab you from back. They go, they stab, who send you? Who send you? They go, they stone you. Who send you to who, who you are you, you who send you who send you to come and fight for us? You are fighting for yourself. Shut up your mouth. Be, be, leave us alone. Be, go away. Get get lost. And you be like, I, I'm fighting for you. Why are you stabbing me? So you must be a madman to say you the fight for Nigerians. No, you can't. If anybody knows you fight for themselves, about everybody just day in day. Sure you get. To me, me, I'm trying to see if uh, my little platform can help raise uh, the consciousness of people, the subconsciousness of the people, whereby you have that uh, critical mass where a lot of people will know that standing up uh, against this oppressive system, this criminal system, it is to everybody's uh, advantage. And nobody wants to be any, nobody should be anybody's hero. So if you can't stand up, and you can't stand up, and you can't stand up, and you too can't stand up, when you know be say, uh, you'll be crippled, right? Then, Everybody just day in day. People perish. Perish together inside, inside that thing. But if they expect somebody to like me, Baba, I know be I know be a crazy person and I'm not a froster that wants to leverage on people's uh, gullibility. Hello there. Hello. Hello, oh, sir. Good, good evening. Good, Baba. good evening. Good evening, sir. How are you? I'm very, very fine. This is a very, very good um topic to today you know thank um, you first of all Good. your platform is first of all your platform is not a little platform your pl platform is the biggest platform oh. teaching out what's happening in nigeria real time so thank your you platform so is not a little platform please thank you baba thanks you th i mean that means a lot because uh, to me i just believe that uh, we are just this little voice even no, though no, we are no, still no, little, no, no. but we are not going to keep quiet we will never shut up even if they tell us that they shut up your mouth, as you know, we will not shut up. Okay, you get until we die. Exactly. Well, thank you so much you for know? saying that. Mm -hmm. 
and that's why you are attracting only sincere people hmm. <laughs> on the platform thanks man now hmm. i'm a Lagosian. bless you you see about they don't be collect all up in Orlando. Just of you wait there abroad. I'm, you go return to Lagos one day. They will tell you see Omar. They don't they don't collect everything. Oh, no. I'm from Badagri. Bless you. And I'm an Egun person. I know how to speak that language properly. Fantastic. I remember you. When someone looked at my mouth and said that about eighty percent of uh, buildings in Lagos State has no sea 